Lower Hillsboro Wilderness Preserve to Oak Ridge Equestrian Campground. It is free camping right here in Florida. However, you need to make a reservation. And as I pull off to the side and look for the code for the blue lock to get through the gate. Alright, I am through the gate. I am going to show you the full one and a half mile drive down the dirt road to the campground. This way you will see what the conditions of the road is so you can check for any clearance issues and that way you can determine if it's going to be suitable for your rig to make the trip to this campground. Alright, so some quick information about this free camping right here in Florida. It is a campground that has no water no electric, no dump station, no garbage facilities, so whatever you pack in, you must pack out and take it with you. And also, these campsites are all first come first serve. Yes, you have to make a reservation, but once you get here, you pick the site that you want and you set up camp. If you are interested in doing any free camping right here in Florida, check out our episode number two in our channel under playlists. We show you a step-by-step -step on how to navigate the website, create an account, and booking a campground. And as you can see by the landscape, you can tell right away this is not like what you would typically think of Florida. So welcome to the real Florida. So I guess the next question from you would be, can I get a big rig into this park? The answer is absolutely. We have a 41 foot fifth wheel and we got it in here just great. And no issues of maneuvering. And the campground itself is pretty level, so setting up was pretty easy. Help others discover this free camping right here in Florida by giving the video a thumbs up. Are you interested in seeing or visiting other free camps grounds right here in Florida? Check out our channel and go under the playlist for free camping in Florida. All right, as we are slowly approaching the campground itself, I just want to mention some of the things you can do while you are visiting this park. Obviously, first thing is you can camp, and you can also do equestrian camping by bringing your horses, and you can do horseback riding through multiple miles of trails. There is hiking, and you can do fishing, and there is also, you can do bike riding. So here's probably another good question in your mind. What type of camping can you do here? You can camp by tent, you can car tent, you can van camp, you can travel trailer, fifth wheel, and of course the equestrian style by bringing your horses.
All right, we finally made it to the campground. The campground itself, from what I could tell, there is five campsites that have picnic tables and a fire ring. And then also there is a day use pavilion with the ability to have a fire there as well. Now, if there is any additional campsites that don't have fire rings, I am not sure. Uh, there is no specific number given when you are booking a site. So as you can see, as we pulled in, there was us and only three other campers here. So as you can see, there is plenty of room for personal space and plenty of shade. So just pick wherever you want to go and set up your camp. And here is the day use pavilion that I had mentioned with the picnic table and the firing. Oh no, somebody broke the rules and left some trash in the fire pit. The campground does provide some porta potties for your convenience. The park also has some non potable water for washing your dishes and giving your horses some water. And it was really neat that it was an old style water pump. Well, the Oak Ridge Equestrian Area did not disappoint. It was a very nice little park, nice and shaded, plenty of room from your neighbors. We sure did like this park and we think you would too. You should consider subscribing to our channel. You'll never know. We may be guilty of adding to your bucket list. And as always, thanks for watching. Two for the road.